Hey, YouTube. Ain't nothing to it but to do it. Hey. What's up, gorgeous? All right, y'all. I just decided to make a video. Did I just show my... Okay. Just decided to make a video. Getting some good exercise. Walking to my mental health doctor's appointment. So... My doctor told me to make sure I do a mental health checkup. You know, it's the holidays, y'all. Everybody need to be safe with their mental health, okay? Don't take no chances. You don't even have to go to no, see no therapist or nothing like that. Me and myself, I pray a lot. Ask for God to keep me and help me carry me out through the day. And of course, you know, you know, one of my mottos is make sure you ask God for forgiveness for the sins that you do and you know not you do. So I just decided to take you guys with me so I can make my try to make sure I make as many videos as possible. Put the work in for practice. So when I get this stuff all the way right, it's going to be tight. All right. So, yeah, I just want to make sure everybody check up on your mental health because it's the holidays and the holidays is really really hard for a lot of people especially when you lost you know a loved one or two or three or however many you know over the years you know this time of year gets hard and sometimes we try to be strong and we are strong but sometimes we try to be strong to the point to where we don't realize, you know, that we're struggling a little bit. You know, we don't want to believe we're struggling. We don't want to dwell on it. We want to have positive thoughts. But, you know, sometimes people don't believe in mental health, you know, checkups. But I say God put doctors and all kind of people in the world to help us along the way. We help each other, you know, so... Uh, it helps me. It does me a lot of good. And I'm very happy to be going. I'm in a positive state. So, you know, I'm not faking or anything. But what makes me mostly in a positive state is that I know I'm taking care of my health. Physical and mental. So, dang, I can't believe I've only been on here for three minutes. I'm a walking sister. I'll be walking. I love the exercise. I need it. I know. I said I'm trying to lose some weight. Shoot, that's stress right there. <laughs> you don't think about losing that weight. But it's okay. I'm just catching it before it gets out of hand. You know. But I always like to walk anyway. I remember my mom telling me the story about her. How she liked to walk. You know. Y'all know I lost my mom in July 2022. So... You know, that's another thing that these holidays is my first holidays without thinking about I need to check up on my mom or get her something, you know, gifts or whatever, or just check up on her, you know, because she was in a hospice, so I couldn't really take gifts up there because they could only have so much stuff by their bedside and, you know, she, uh, she couldn't talk or walk, so um, you know, she was kind of mentally gone a lot. So, you know, she had, uh, Alzheimer's. So anyway, um, yeah, I'm still grieving. So I'm trying to make sure I take care of myself because, you know, I still, um, have myself to look after and my family, my loved ones that I look after, even though some of them don't know I look after them, <laughs> but I don't know I pray for them and stuff. You know, but uh, there's all kind of things you can do to help take care of family or don't cost money, you know. And prayer is, it could be for anybody, in relig any religion. It's not about religion. You know, it's just about keeping in contact with God, you know. Making sure you're good and making sure you're right with God. Check in with them at least once a day. I talk to him all day long because I talk to myself, so I 
I have to tell myself, you can't be just talking to yourself, you gotta talk to God too, all during the day. So, yeah, I just thought this would be a nice, important video. And to, you know, anyone that's out there lonely, like an older person or person don't have no kids or, or you the person don't have any family or you're an orphan, because even though at my age, I be feeling like an orphan, but you know, I have to snap back into reality and realize at least I do have my grandkids. So, and my kids, so, um, yeah. So, but there's really people out there that don't have anybody. So, I just wanna give this uplifting video, put it out into the universe, you know, that, you know, I do God's work and uplift somebody and even though my videos might seem um they might seem uh boring or whatever I don't care I'm posting anyway <laughs> who knows it might help somebody you know it don't even have to be somebody that's not watching my videos that I don't know it could be somebody that I know that's watching my videos and I don't know who's watching my videos so um I'm almost at the doctor I'm almost at the doctor. So I'm feeling pretty good today. And, um, oh yeah, I gotta go to the eye doctor too. Yeah, yeah, I got my contacts. I finally got my contacts back. Paid for them in advance. Finally got them. But I don't know if they're marked right or left. So that's like another thing. Your health has a lot to do with your mental. Like, if my eyes is not functioning right, I'm trying to tell you. My eyes not functioning right. A lot of times I'm not functioning right. Sorry for the lighting, guys. I'm walking against the sun, so it is what it is. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, it is a lot of times, um, I don't know if people realize this, but if you're um, depressed or something and you go to the doctor, you know, for your mental health, they will suggest, you know, or, slightly demand that you know you get a physical checkup because a lot of times your physical can mess with your mental and by you going through something like that you don't realize that you don't know you know so you know if your physical is acting up and your mental is acting up and you wonder why you mentally frustrated or you don't understand what's going on it's good to make sure you get that Physical checkup. Yay. Hey y'all. Oh gosh. Okay. So I'm almost at the doctor. And this is me checking in because ain't nothing to it but to do it. It is a beautiful day. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful day. Almost, almost at the doctor, and I'm just now fixing my jacket. But anyway, guys, so I'm running just slightly a little bit late, but not much. I really just want to get the sun. It gets dark so early. Like, you can plan on getting some sun, and you waiting, and lollygagging around, and saying oh i'm gonna get out there i'm gonna get out there and before you know it the sun gone you at work you take your lunch break you might stay in you know you got still got to be careful the holidays with all this cold and flu and sinus and allergies you know it just be a lot going on so y'all please don't feel bad about getting your mental health check you know even if you just Talk to somebody in the family. You don't have to be a mental health doctor or nothing like that. Some people don't believe in therapy. You know, each to its own, you know, how they feel about the situation. But, so, okay, guys. I'll be liking my videos to be a little longer than this. But I can't always push it. You know what I'm saying? Everybody have a happy holiday season. And, and be well. Okay? Be well. Because ain't nothing to it. Let's do it. Peace.